Thank you for joining us here at HockeyUs.com. Don't forget to go to our website, HockeyUs.com. Become a member today. It only takes three simple steps. Help us rate the products that you're seeing viewed here and also the other products that you see listed on our website. Uh, the glove that we're going to be reviewing for you today is the Bauer Pro 4 Roll Glove. Now this is a 12 inch glove uh, for you guys out there. We did it a little bit of a smaller size to help get into the camera uh, so we can show you different angles in this and um, you know, so you can kind of see the contrast on how uh, big the fingers are and I'm going to give you a general idea uh, you know what size uh, that I would wear and uh, and how to uh, purchase these gloves. This glove um, I think we're pretty sure that we did a review on these before when it had the plain uh, Bauer up here along with the Nike logo and this is Bauer's new logo since they've uh, been uh, you know, actually, since Nike now has sold them to a uh, to a different company that has purchased them, um, this glove here is like I said, just your regular single single cell foam. It's got your tricot nylon uh, outer shell. Uh, it's really nice. It's got the, and the reason why they call it Pro Four Rolls because there's one, two, three, four rolls here, and that's your your uh, traditional glove. More of a fast back would have a design that would come down here where your knuckles would bend in this way, and that's the reason why this is your traditional fit. Um, again, it only has a single cell foam in here. And there's um, there's PVC, there's no PVC inserts inside of this glove whatsoever. Um, so this is uh, true like a lot of NHL guys like this glove because it stays nice and wet and uh, without the PVC inserts in there, um, you know, it actually dries out a little easier when they put it on those, uh, those glove dryers. If you look here, it looks like it has a piece of screen. I'm going to try to get this in here for you guys. It looks like it actually has a little piece of screen in here and basically what that is for uh, is, to, uh, is, is to let the air come in through here and keep the glove nice and dry and uh, lightweight uh, throughout the whole time. Um, again, this, this glove is uh, a 12 inch and uh, it's, let me see here, the gram that uh, we weigh this at is 276 grams at a 12 inch. And uh, this is a real nice glove. I'm going to show you the inside here. I don't know if you guys can pick this up, but it actually has a couple little, I'll pull this out. It actually has a couple little ports that they, uh, that they board in here to help with the air ventilation that actually goes through. Uh, these uh, channels here and again Nike's calling the single cell foam armor foam as you can see uh, listed right over here they really didn't change much to the glove the only thing that they changed was the logos that were on here and again this glove retails for a price at around $109 uh, in, in most uh, local retail stores and sometimes you might find it a little cheaper or a little bit more depending on the size uh, so I'm going to rate this product here for you today. Uh, again, I'm going strictly off of this glove that I have here in my hand. Uh, we did not go back and look at our archives to see the uh, older uh, reviews from the Le Nike's last uh, Pro 4 Roll glove, so I'm going to give you my honest opinion on this glove today. Uh, as far as comfort, I'm going to give it a 4. Uh, the only thing that I don't really like about this glove is, to me, the fingers feel a little short. Even though it's a 12-inch glove, I did try the 13 and a 14 on, and it just seemed that the fingers were a little on the uh, shorter side. So if, uh, if a guy might usually wear a 13, he might have to try a 14 to see if it fits him a little bit better. Uh, durability, I'm going to give it a 4 again with the, um, with the tricot nylon that's in here and also the uh, single cell foam. Uh, I'll give it a 4 as far as durability. And uh, fit, I'm going to give it another 4 for fit because they don't go uh, down to an 8 or 9 inch glove like uh, most of the other gloves uh, do. Um, you know, as far as uh, they should continue this line all the way down into those sizes, but they don't. Flexibility, again, I'll give it a five. This is a very, very nice flexible glove. Uh, this glove we actually just took out of the package. And uh, as you can see here, I can more move my fingers all over the place. It's not restrictive. Uh, more or less feels like um, something that you've been wearing for you know a month or so, uh, a new glove is, uh, that's just out of the package. That's an, another plus to it. Protection, I'm going to give it a five with a single cell foam. It doesn't have to have the PVC inserts. It's a high grade, the single cell foam that they're using in here. And uh, pretty much, if hey, look, if the NHL guys are wearing this, then any, any of us playing men's league or, or juniors or college can use the same glove. Uh, visual looks, I'm going to give it a five. Uh, just a plain, simple Bauer Nike logo. That's their new logo that's in here. Plain graphics. It does come in different colors, too. And weight at uh, 276 grams, I'm going to give it a 5 as far as weight because it is very, very nice and light. And again, along with these power vents that they put in here inside the glove and also on the outside of the glove, helps keep this glove really nice, lightweight, and dry. Uh, the price on this, again, is about 109 US, and uh, we saw this here at HockeyUs.com. If you have any qu comments on this glove, uh, please write in if you do have these, even the older version. Since they really didn't change much, uh, let us know what you think about these gloves or any other products we have listed here at HockeyUs.com. Thanks for stopping by today.